Well, this is a, a, a great example uh, of an innovative business here um, that uh, is you know, uh, part of the future economy uh, of our province. So when you see in the, in the kinds of investments we make, things like the digital media tax credit and those kinds of incentives, they are key to ensuring that we are able to uh, secure the good jobs that come uh, out, of that, out of these emerging, tech, emerging technologies, these emerging industries. Um, the, the, the young people who are working here, uh, as, you, as you've already heard, come from uh, programs at uh, Dalhousie are, are uh, post-secondary institutions. It means that they're able to stay here, that they are able to build their lives here, uh, have their families here. Uh, this is important to building a better future for the families of this province. Both the, the Liberals and, and Conservatives have said they're opposed to investing um, uh, in these kinds of jobs. Uh, I, I believe it is a great risk uh, uh, for Nova Scotia if we were to do things that would make us less competitive, that would make the uh, innovative entrepreneurs uh, who are here now want to, want to stay. But they've been very clear. Uh, they've been very critical of any investment that brings jobs or job opportunities here uh, to the province. And I think that uh, is the wrong way. The, the, the failed policies of the uh, Liberals and the Conservatives in, the, in past governments um, uh, has, uh, you know, led us uh, to the worst economy in the in the country for 20 years. And I think if we don't compete. If I, I think if we're not prepared uh, to take advantage of opportunities, then Nova Scotia will suffer a fate that is less than we deserve. We have great opportunities here. We have great young people. We have uh, just we have some of the best educational institutions uh, anywhere in North America. We we should be building on that foundation, not uh, not running away from it. The tax credit is uh, is going to continue to be in place, um, as we have done with the uh, film tax credit. And I and I made this point before: if you don't put the tax credit in place for these kinds of industries, um, and the Department of Finance always looks at it as, well, this is uh, a loss of revenue on the finance side. But you know, if they're not here, then there's no revenue at all. So you can have 100 percent of nothing. Or you can have uh, the, the, the benefits and good jobs that go along with having a, a vibrant industry like this one. So what's your